People are really, really fear-based and not uh, are, like afraid of like whatever is not how they were brought up, and afraid of whatever is whatever would make them like more insecure about their lives or something. Or make them uncomfortable. They, yeah, they just want to have the comfortable mindset. They just want to see things um, in light and just I don't know go into the whole ignorance is bliss, which it can be, but it's not justifiable. It's not true bliss. It's not. It's not truth. And I think truth is equally as important as happiness. And I think truth can bring us uh, like true, um, real, like uh, I don't know, real fucking happiness. Yeah. So. Well. Yeah. One thing. There's one song about Operation Cleveland yeah. that like really speaks to me because it was like, it was like I, I seriously. It's like I can't stand having my beliefs around most people in my communities and stuff because like every time like it, since I buy sweatshop free shoes or like if I buy I buy sweatshop free shoes or if since I'm a vegetarian or since I like I'm an anarchist and I am like anti-authoritarian and believe that like people like work together better cooperatively rather than like bossing each other around and stuff just all because like those beliefs and stuff everyone acts like oh yeah my anti-capitalist ideals and everything people always say like oh well what are you going to do tear down the government or what are you going to do uh, to shut down all the sweatshops you can't change the world you can't do this you can't do that and that is just such bullshit because uh, because uh, first of all I never said I, it was possible for me to do any of those things the the main of course that's a driving factor behind what I do of course it is but it's not the reason I do it obviously there's very much evidence for all of the like, the causes I have to be 100% completely hopeless I do it for myself I buy sweatshop free shoes to know that I'm not supporting that I do it for myself to feel better I'm a vegetarian to not support like not to not support the do not support uh, like all the whole the reasons for being a vegetarian and like all my beliefs are for myself I'm not afraid of being aware I'm not afraid of understanding the world I'm not afraid of learning and gaining more knowledge and like there's nothing wrong there's that's a good thing people think just because you gain knowledge all of a sudden you're gonna like try to go and tear down the government and like that's you, you you can't just dismiss things but because of that fear you have to open your mind and be knowledgeable about stuff and like there's nothing wrong with that you could take and do whatever you want if you want to be like a crazy revolutionary then go ahead but if you want to if you want to simply think about things like that's fine too like that's a first step to anything like yeah it's a, it's a first step i'm just in the world and it's, it's better than not doing anything like and i hate it whenever you try to do something good and people always say it's not good enough like you're a vegetarian oh but you know the car you drive it has leather in it and you eat eggs and you drink milk so you're really not a good person, and you're not really doing anything. Yeah, like exactly. Every little bit counts. Obviously, obviously, in like our society, we can't. It's impossible to to like be 100 percent pure, and we we always we we have to support like capitalist corporations. We have to like do all that because like it, it's it's just like our, our means of survival in this society, and like you can't. There's no way. But there's if anyone chooses to do make a little difference, all of a sudden everyone's pointing out all the other stuff they do.